about it? It's hugely exciting to see this project come from drawings to being constructed to now being here in the theatre, seeing uh, almost complete sensing the amount of atmosphere that's going to be here during every show. I, I can't wait. It's really putting Western Sydney on the map when it comes to arts and cultural activities. Yeah, what does well, the first thing it means is we don't have to travel. So we've had to travel to access fantastic theatre spaces. Now we've got probably Sydney's best theatre right here in our own backyard. And then the second thing it means is that people can come to Western Sydney, enjoy fantastic food, enjoy the natural landscapes that we've got here and pick up a show as well. So mm. Western Sydney's got it all and this theatre just proves that. And also jobs at West HQ too. Yeah, no doubt. This has been a fantastic example of a community organisation that's really reinvented itself, uh, really tapped into the fact that people in Western Sydney want to be able to access high quality products, high quality food, and they've provided that to their customer. And that's why this place is going really, really well. And I expect them to go from strength to strength as more people make their way to West HQ. Yeah, just finally, I'm at the Opera House. What do you think? Well, Sydney Coliseum, we might just shade the Opera House. They can come out, have a look, see what we're doing. They can improve their game in the East. It's really varied, so I cover a lot of things. I cover um, client services, presenter services, um, welcoming um, the hires and promoters into the building when the company start through, making sure that they have everything they require for, for the productions and all of that. So it's quite varied, <laughs> which is exciting. So do you start to get that experience? Absolutely. Like I've had a, a number of years uh, touring interstate and overseas at many of the theatres, and to have one in my own backyard is really exciting. Um, and also to bring it um, bring it to the people of Western Sydney, the residents of Western Sydney, to enjoy um, live entertainment and theatre in their own backyard is great. How long? Um, so I've been on board since March, and it's been amazing kind of to see this building take shape over the last couple of months. It's really shaped up to become this beautiful theatre. Um, but yeah, it just you know, it's a rare opportunity to to be on a journey of building a theatre. So. It's been very exciting. So the launch, how did it take me through the emotions? Um, I think it's going to be everything at once. It's going to be a roller coaster or a train ride. Um, it definitely excited, definitely nerve wracking, and definitely bittersweet once it's all over. So yeah, no, but really excited at the same time. And you say bittersweet. My role here is uh, Head of Audio for Sydney Coliseum Theatre. I pretty much look after all the high tech audio equipment within the facility, ensuring that all the performances and all the artists visiting um, are looked after and we can meet all the requirements for everything moving forward. It's a pretty exciting role for coming. Oh, very exciting. It's, uh, it's going to be a great time ahead, getting to work with uh, some real high profile artists and technical personnel. So we're looking forward to uh, the challenge and also adding my experience to the team. Now, West End. It's amazing for me. It means that, um, you know, people don't have to travel too far in the city to watch a high end performance. They can just be at their doorstep and uh, be involved in a facility that's state of the art and watch some real high end performances and, and shows. For me, it's great being close to home. Uh, travelling to work and uh, doing a job which I am really passionate about. Have you had West HQ uh, is a, a destination, a precinct which offers uh, multiple different uh, businesses and offerings to local community, from entertainment to uh, food and beverage options. It's uh, it's a great place to come and visit and uh, see what's happening in Greater Western Sydney. And pretty exciting, given that you're a local as well. Very much so. Um, it's a it's, it's a pleasure working here. It's a, it's a really great destination. Scan your access in. Yeah, and okay. the gracefully recognised you. Um, you've been here in Yeah, yeah. Time, and we've got the new China Doll opening upstairs in the next week. Uh, yeah, and um, David Campbell. David Campbell, That's yeah. Right. I'm sure it won't be you, so. Um, but yeah, you, you'd notice a big difference. Yeah, yeah, it's good. You would have when you drove in? Yeah, oh, no doubt. Well, it's quite special because what we've also had to do is what you see now to your right. Mm. We have to change the whole experience. So when you make your way through here, they enter on that side. That's why all those they new walk digital through, recognition, yeah. and then they walk through the club, like what we've just done yeah, now. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So, and then you walk through here. Yeah. And you're in. Mm. So you come in both ways, and there's there's the new the new Ch uh, Chu Chinese restaurant. Oh yeah. So um, we're just trying to doll. Looks just like the render. It does. You wait to, It's amazing how they, what they do with those images, how it becomes reality. Okay. Hello, Ben. Minister Ayres, this is our project manager. Yeah, how are you? Good to see you. Yeah. Times. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, mate. Lifelong project. So, just would you mind uh, yeah, showing us, taking us through? You wanna, wanna see? They want to see, and it's selling well. Would you believe? 
And saying the other one that's selling out well is the... Sydney is the dance centre capital but, but of just, Australia. But, but so it's just <laughs> overwhelming. Because so, it's not. It's not. Hey, how are you? Good, mate. How are you? It's overwhelming. What, well, do you want to go down there and do that? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Let's go down to... They're down onto the stage here. Yeah. With the quality of it. Do you want to do... And that's for sure. Good news, mate. Lots of good stuff. Yeah, there is lots of good things. There's more stuff coming as well, so... Yeah, might be a quiet run to the end of the year, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. When do you break up? Get that's, away. That's a very good idea. So... It's the first of its kind in the world, that seating. What's the rate degree, do you know? It's C60. C60, 60 yeah. yeah. Which is... I, what I like about it is you can see every face. Yeah. It's like being in a... Well, it's, it's a big theatre. And, um... The wood panelling, even though it looks great, its whole its acoustic property will be unreal. It is, and that's the beat the strength of production on and a rehearsal production. Mm. Totally different. Yeah. So, and then we've got the capacity to have semi-trailers on site. Yeah. Unloading sets so they don't have to be off-site, mm. you know, being ferried in. But to have the, the rehearsal stage out the back where you can have two different performances here <laughs> at the one time. Yeah. It's, it's world's best. Yeah. It really is true. And when you're going down, look at that fly tower. Mm. But the size of the stage can do with ballet, 